What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video, guys. Second video today. We have a lot to talk about, all right? It's not really about the market. It's about rarity of cars. So if you guys want to stay tuned, stay tuned. It's kind of both. It's kind of both. It has to do with MT. So I wanted to bring it up to you guys. Because honestly, it's making me think. There's a lot to talk about in this mar in this video. So make sure to drop that 20,000 MT uh, down below. As well as drop the sub, like the vid sub if you are new. And once again, thank you for 3K. Also, um, check out my new coin sponsor. I just got a new one. Shout out to them, man. They slid in my DMs, worked with me, and they're amazing. So go check them out. YBC also has them. Big C Richie with his 2K. They are legit. All of them have them. They're a big boy baller. And for me to have them is just amazing. Like, thank you guys. So, yeah. Drop the like. Check them out. And let's go. So, right now, we have to talk about the rarity of cards and packs. And one thing I want to talk about is sets. Like, some sets go like this. They drop in value. They go up. They drop. One card drops. They go up. So... I'm going to talk a lot about the sets. And also, if you guys don't know, these packs are going tomorrow. We're going to see some content. Possibly Spotlight Series content. Honestly, kind of hype. Kind of hype. Kind of hype. So, let's get into this. So, if you don't know, first off, if you didn't check out my other video, go check out. Check it out. Get your cards. Sell them. Get rid of all your cards. That's all I'm going to say. Next up. So why did I make this video? I made this video because it makes me crazy to think how this whole set goes for the low and then this one card that's useless goes for 300k plus. Now, how does this happen? I don't understand. So this is why I never, I say do, do not lock in sets. So they dropped a pack. If you don't know, they dropped the best of 2k20 packs. Every card was in the pack here besides this one. So they literally destroyed the set besides one card. Whoever had this card for around 100k, 100K was very lucky. His rarity level went from probably, I would say, a 5 out of 10 to a 1 out of 10. I mean, a 10 out of 10. His rarity in this game is insanity. If you somehow pull him in like a triple threat pack, you are literally 500k richer. This card right here. Let's go over the whole set. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. So, if you have Bill Walton, let me know. Because I would like to know. So, this whole set. He's 30. He's under 30. So, let's say 25. 30, 25. Alright. He's 2k. <laughs> so, let's just say 60k for all of them. He's 20k. So, 60, 20, 80k. This card is 500k. I might sit on the auction all day and try to snipe out this card. There's not only this set. This this is the only set where it's this this is crazy. I actually announced this in my other video. I was like kind of shocked. So nobody. This is one thing I don't understand. So what tip to you guys? If you hear there's content coming out, you guys know the cards, and you have, let's say, all right, for instance. So let's say. The content came out. You knew Bernard Kings were dropping in packs. Dr run to the packs. Run. I mean, run to the auction. Sell your Bernard King. If you didn't hear Bill Walters in packs, stock up on them. It's that simple. Um, there's a lot to talk about. I'm going to go over a lot in this video. Don't worry. And yes, guys. I am still sick. I'm literally dying. So, I just feel like crap. So, if I do sound weird, that's my bad. So, all right. Next set. So, we got this set. You guys all know this set for Ray Allen. So, now... This guy's cheap. This guy's cheap. Now, since he's cheap and he's cheap, he dropped in packs. His value dropped. Now it's back up. So he was around 180. Now he's around 3 plus. So, with a shoe, he's 360. Kids on crack. All right. So we got Rose for around 3. He's drawing up. So now, out of nowhere, 2K drops a locker code. It was That's why I said sell every card you have because I knew they were going to drop a locker code and destroy the market. What happens? They did. So now that was a given. I told you guys to sell. So they dropped the stock in the will impacts. That's kind of cool. Now, what happens if you guys pull Tracy McGrady? He was around 350 yesterday. He's going to go for over 500,000 MT now just because of this. 
And also, this, wow, he's 400K. He went up triple. He went up triple. He was 100 something K when the packs were out. He's literally 400K. I don't know if that's actual, actually true. But if you have yourself a Tim Duncan, a D Rose, and Tracy, and you want to sell, go ahead and sell. They have their most value now. As the days go on, they're going to go down probably because these are probably going to rise. These could rise a little bit. They might not. But if they're this expensive, you never know what 2K can do. They could drop a locker code and ruin your day. They could drop something and ruin your day. This is just a heads up telling you guys to take your MT and get out. Like literally. You never know. So this is for two. This is for Galaxy over Ray, Ray Allen. There's another set. I believe it's here. So 200 tokens, right? So this one is interesting too. So they dropped the Nate Thurman in packs. Look how cheap he is. If you remember, he was way over 100K under 40k so that's whack nate thurman under 40k wow he was like way over 100k he was rare lucas look at this guy this guy goes from not rare at all 70k to rare out of nowhere because he's not in packs so they picked they chose a bunch of random pink diamonds to put in the pack so that's interesting like 2k is whack they chose random people to be in the packs they had no strategies they just took random people from sets and chucked them in packs that's number one. This guy has rarity, probably 200k plus. Right here. He went down. What happens since they dropped the locker code? He's dirt cheap. Now, what happens? Mark Price gains value. Under 100k, way under. He was under 80k. He now is 100k plus. So now he went from about 70k to over 100k plus. So now, now we got this guy. There was just a bid on him for 200 something k. He sold. He now has insane amount of value. Bro, 2K is giving these bums this much value. I need to somehow, if there's some way I can snipe out one of these cards, you'll be loaded. This card just had a 200 and something. No, well, it was either this card or it was either Maurice Lucas. I'm not sure. But you guys have to realize that these bum cards have value out of nowhere. This is why I'm just confused. Um, It is for 200 tokens. Personally, 200 tokens isn't worth that much. I'm just saying... I have 404 waiting for new tokens to drop. That would be kind of cool. I can't get in the pink diamond phase, but I'm in the diamond. But uh, yeah, what do you guys think about this? Honestly, right now, I'm kind of confused. Uh, they 2K has dropped the packs. They only released certain cards. Why? I don't know. Maybe because these, these guys were more recent. I'm not sure. But with that said, pretty much any cards you guys have, I would honestly go guarantee and sell. Go on the market, sell. Do not lose all your MT. Do not lose the rarity of these two, these three. Don't lose the rarity of your Bill Waltons. If you have Bill Waltons, I'm going to say this one more time. You're crazy, but better go ahead and sell because he's that expensive. He is that expensive. 320, he do. He has a 310k bid with an hour 27 left. I'm going to do my needs and I'm going to drop a 150 on it. If I get it for 150, God bless me, my soul, because I'm doing this set, like literally doing this set. So yeah, keep your eyes out. Let me know if you get any snipes of Bill Walton. This might be the new sniping method right here. Nate Thurman might be a good sniping method. All these cards are good snipes. Maurice Lucas, Mark Price, and Phil Sheeter. Keep your eyes out. Let me know what's going on. If you have them in your collection, you're welcome. I'm just saying. I mean, you probably would know if you have them in your collection. But this would probably be the best time to sell. Packs are dropping tomorrow. It could be new content. It could just be a spotlight. I mean, it's going to be new content. I think it's going to be a spotlight. That's the thing. So, we got this. It was two weeks ago. We're probably going to have... I mean, we had a center one. I could see a point guard one. We haven't really had a good, solid point guard one. I could see a pink diamond point guard uh, evolution coming soon. Maybe it would be cool if it was like a big O. So, yeah, man. Keep your eyes out. And other than that, it's like, if there's anything you guys want me to say in my videos, want me to talk about, let me know. And also, if you guys have any cards to sell, drop it in the comments. Let me know. Do not sell all your cards. You can sell most of your cards besides Wilt. Don't sell your Stocktons. Don't sell your David Thompsons. Keep them for now. Let them rise like about a month. I'm not even kidding. They're, so, they're too cheap right now. If you wait a month, they could possibly go up to 70k plus. And it will make a lot of empty. But realistically... Other than that, that's really all I got. And honestly, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more content. This set, 
the rarity of these sets got me going crazy. Let me know what you think down below. I just wanted to point this out to the community and hopefully, guys, you can get it out. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one, guys. Peace.